In this Prisma Cloud demonstration, we're going to give you an overview into some of our cloud network security capabilities. Prisma Cloud delivers an application dependency map, illustrating the workloads that you're protecting, as well as how they're communicating. Workloads could be containers or hosts spanned across public clouds like Amazon, Google, Azure, and Oracle, or they could be running in any private cloud data center. With Prisma Cloud, you can click on any one of the workloads here and get a detailed view about flows to and from the workload, the policies protecting the workload, and tags, tags that are assigned to it. These tags make up the identity of the workload, and Prisma Cloud automatically pulls metadata straight from your orchestration platforms like Kubernetes and OpenShift, your cloud service providers, and tags that users and application developers may have assigned to provide application annotations. With Prisma Cloud, you can see the flows happening between each and every workload. Here, we have a red flow indicating that it was blocked by policy and green indicating that it was allowed. With Prisma Cloud, we, we help you safely enable segmentation by deploying the agent in a permissive mode that allows all traffic by default. What this does is allows you to see your application dependencies without breaking or blocking any communications you may have wanted allowed. Anytime this happens, the green flows will show up as dotted lines. And then once you write policy and that flow is covered by policy, we'll change it into a green solid line. So here you can see that this uh, payment workload is communicating out to salesforce.com and we're allowing it because we've written a policy to allow it. Now, when it comes to writing policy, there are several different ways you can get started. One of the easiest ways to get started is with out of the box rules. Out of the box rules provides predefined rule sets for any common application and use case. An example could be securing um, common infrastructure services like DHCP, DNS, or even SSH remote access. You may want to protect uh, outbound access to the internet or outbound access to repositories like Linux and Windows system updates. You may even want to secure Kubernetes clusters, and we provide several different predefined rule sets to protect different Kubernetes cluster use cases. Really, for any cloud native application, we offer another workflow that makes it simple to enforce least privileged segmentation. By running application profiling, we compute all the flows on the screen here and generate the optimal segmentation policy for any cloud native app. Here's an example where the payment dev app is allowed to talk to other things in the payment dev app and things in the payment prod app are able to talk to other things within payment prod. If you want to get more details or edit it, we allow you to do that in this workflow. If you want to see visually see the policy impact on these workloads, click this highlight button and you'll see that we're only impacting policy for this payment dev application. If you're ready and feel comfortable with these policies, you can simply click create rule sets. And in other environments where you may have a mature DevOps model, you can even codify this and insert into your CI CD pipelines. One way to do that is to simply click this export button, where we'll download a codified policy into a YAML file, and it looks like this something that DevOps teams and individual application developers are familiar with and can incorporate this into their automated deployment workflows. One thing I want to leave you with as part of this demonstration is different ways to view logs. Here in our flow logging mechanism, you can see individual flows, how they're accepted and rejected, who is it from, who is it to, as well as port and protocols. And you can even see the policies that they've allowed or denied the individual flows. With Prisma Cloud, you can export these flows to your SIM collectors or even other data collectors for longer term storage. This has been an overview of some of our cloud network security capabilities within Prisma Cloud. I want to thank you for viewing.